Okay, everybody. Hi. Hi. How you guys doing? <laughs> doing We're good. Nice to meet you. you. I'm doing great. I, I'm just excited to be with you guys. I just binged all eight episodes, so it's crazy kind of being hey. with the paper girls themselves right now. And everybody, that is Fina Straza, a.k.a. KJ, Riley, Lee, Nellett, a.k.a. Aaron, and Cameron Jones, a.k.a. Tiffany. Paper Girls out now. Prime video. Spoilers in this interview, so make sure you watch the full season first before you watch this interview. How are you guys doing today? We're doing, doing good. well. <laughs> Good. Um, so my first question is for Fina. Were you always going to play KJ or did you ever audition for anyone else as well? Uh, I actually auditioned for Mac as well. I went through my entire audition process and I screen tested for KJ and for Mac. So Ooh. I... F- funny you asked that. <laughs> that is very interesting. And that's that's going to get a lot of people talking about that. That's so cool. Um yeah, and look, I'm happy you're playing KJ. You absolutely bring that character to life and do an Thank amazing job. Thank you. Jobs. I definitely think they made the right decision all around. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. Now, uh, Riley, do you find a lot of yourself in the character of Aaron, or do you find a lot of differences? Um, I think at first what really drew me to playing Aaron was that I feel like we differentiate in a lot of ways. But as I got to know her more, I really started to find bits of myself in that sense of having duty and honor is what my dad always taught me. And um, yeah, I just learned to love that she really tries to take care of the people that she loves. And um, I'm excited for people to see her. Yeah, and I love what you bring to Erin and that she's honorable, like you're saying, and a leader, really awesome. And Cameron, are you excited now being in this big franchise series based off this big comic that you're going to now eventually have these Tiffany Funko Pops appear, action figures, going to conventions. Is that like insane for you right now? Yeah, I'm very excited for that. Like I'm ready for them to start making Tiff's walkie talkies a toy. Like I think it would be so cool to have a Tiff Funko Pop. I'd buy one immediately. Like (laughs) I would post it all over. I, and we're going to Comic Con. Like I don't, that I'm so excited for that. And I can't wait. Yeah, no, that's great to see you're excited about that. And it's definitely coming. It's so deserving. So really cool. And then uh, Fina, the the moment a lot of people are going to talk about is in the finale, Mac puts her hand on KJ's hand in the barn. How, what was KJ, just like that, exactly. (laughs) What was was KJ (laughs) feeling in that moment, would you say? Or what are you feeling in this moment right now? Well, <laughs> we should like we're here just, to, just so that we can. How are you feeling? Yeah, thanks. That that helps. <laughs> um, <laughs> I KJ is feeling a lot of things. I mean, she she's always known that there's been something that doesn't quite fit in about her, and she's known that there's been something about her that she hasn't discovered yet and so when she does discover that she is gay in the future she or in in the future she discovers she's gay she's always gay Mm -hmm. (laughs) 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 when she discovers that she has to come to terms with it because she's grown up in the 80s and is it has been taught that that is not okay and so in that moment she is definitely feeling a lot of things she has this relationship with mac where they are often butting heads and in this moment where mac has softened she doesn't know how to deal with it and we'll see what happens with that if we're able to explore it more possibly in a second season fingers crossed yeah definitely everyone fingers crossed and that's yeah kj and mac we're excited to see that kind of relationship evolve it's gonna be interesting and Riley, from people following you on Instagram, you could see that you are a absolute legend in the field of martial arts. Can you push (laughs) for Aaron to be able to use some martial arts if we have this possible season two? You know, I feel yeah, I feel like in this first season it wouldn't it wouldn't (laughs) make a lot of sense if she knew (laughs) martial arts. But yeah, I was talking to um, our writers about that. Like, if we wanted to do another season, it would be cool to kind of venture off into. Um, using martial arts because I one day want to do my own stunts and um, even coordinate them and that would be a lot of fun. Oh that's exciting to hear yeah Yeah, and it'd be cool to see you bring your martial arts skills into stunt as well. Um, Cameron I'm gonna ask you a hard question what do you think is the biggest change in Tiffany from the start of season one to the end like her journey what do you what would you say? Wow, this is hard. You were right. This is a hard question. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'd say 
Tiff was very much a loner at the beginning of season one. She didn't have a lot of friends, so she did turn towards turn towards technology for her comfort and leaning in towards school and knowledge and using that to replace her friends. And by the end, I feel like she cares about these girls very, very much. And she's let people in. And um, she was the, the cliffhanger made her very, very, very sad because she accepted them, she cares about them, she finally felt comfortable with the group of girls. Like, I'd say the biggest change is that she accepted that it's okay to let people in. I love that answer. And yeah, I could totally see that too. And you did a great job of showing that arc going through the season. Um, Now, same question for all of you. We'll start with Fina, you're gonna lead off, but what was your favorite moment of season one favorite moment like watching it or to film either one your call Mm -hmm. well i'd say just watching overall i love the pilot i think it's such a fun ride and it's so intense (laughs) and i every time i watch it i I just love it even more and then to film well i one of my favorite moments to film was also in the pilot the scenes in the car where mm. where Riley's dying. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was her favorite part was to yeah. Yeah, die. Yeah, I loved that. Uh, <laughs> because we we had a stunt driver who was in a little baby car that was attached, <laughs> attached to the side that had full control over the station wagon. And so Cameron was really sitting in that front mm-hmm. seat, and so we were able to shoot out the front windshield. There was no trailer pulling the car. So um, they really sent us down a road, two and a half miles. Swiveled. And swerved the car like crazy so all like the bumping that you may see is real we really screeched to a stop that was yeah. very intense and, and yeah. I think Bonnet that caught that, us really yeah. oh, right. sure. it was so fun so dangerous yeah so fun <laughs> so that it was that not was dangerous because we were actually really really safe like the stunt coordinator and everybody was great <laughs> yeah <laughs> um I think I think my favorite part was scenes yeah like the car scene where the stakes were just really really high I loved doing the forest battle scene that was a lot Lot of fun, um, <laughs> yeah. All the all the dirt, most of the dirt that you see flying around is made of chocolate cake and cookies and cereal. <laughs> wow, it smelled really good. It smelled really good. The camera, <laughs> what, what was yours being? I think my favorite ones to film were the car scenes. I really liked the second one in. Episode three? In, three? I think it's three. I think it's it is three. three. It is that three. one was really fun because yeah. I remember it was really high impact and she was <laughs> into oh my, my gosh, shoulder that scene, I, and I she kept, was yelling at me. <laughs> I kept I kept like laughing. <laughs> not laughing, but I kept trying not to laugh to the point where like, okay, Cameron's driving I'm, the car. I'm here. And then I'm like <laughs> no, she's, she's <laughs> and she is shaking my arm as I'm pretending to drive, and I'm trying so hard not to laugh. And that was really, really fun. And she's yeah. yelling at it me in the back. It was super hectic. Scene. It was so hectic. Keep your eyes on the road. Yeah, Why are we moving like a turtle. Was, so that was my favorite yeah. to and film. the rain. The, yeah, yeah, that was the, my favorite to watch. Yeah. The rave, like, the party. Oh. It was very it was a party like, there, aesthetically yeah, yeah. and visually pleasing. Mm. I, I love it all. And for everyone who's seen the show, I mean, every scene was amazing to watch. And thank you guys again for joining me. Watch Fina, Cameron, and Riley kill it. It's on Prime Video now and Paper Girls. Hope to talk to you guys in the future one day. Thank, thank you for your time. Thank you for having us. You. Have a great thank day. You. Bye. Bye. Bye.